Hello friends, welcome to another video of Zeta Axis. Today we are going to see important rivers of Odisha. Now we have already discussed Mahanadi river in another video. So in this video we will be focusing on rivers other than Mahanadi. The next important river is Brahmani river. The Brahmani river is a major seasonal river of Odisha. It is formed by confluence of rivers South Coil and Sunk near Raurkela city. Sunk river originates from Rachi plateau of Chota Nagpur plateau in Gumla district of Jharkhand. The Sunk flows from Jharkhand and then enters Jaspur district of Chhattisgarh and re-enters Jharkhand. From Jharkhand, Sunk river enters Odisha in Sundargarh district. The Sunk river joins South Coil river near Raurkela to form Brahmani river. The South Coil river originates from Lohar Daga district of Jharkhand in Chota Nagpur. The South Coal River flows through West Singhum district in Jharkhand and enters Odisha in Sundargarh district, where South Coal River merges with Sunk River at Vedavyas near Raurkela to form Brahmani River. Now, after the confluence of these two rivers, that is South Coal River and Sunk River, they flow as Brahmani River. The Brahmani River flows to Bonegar in Sundargarh district and then it flows through Thalcher, which is an important coal mine. The Brahmani River divides into several channels before flowing into Bay of Bengal in Kendrapa district of Odisha. A distributary of Mahanadi River called Birupa River flows into Brahmani's distributary called Kimiria. The Kimiria then rejoins Brahmani River at Indupur. A distributary of Brahmani River joins Paitarani River. The Brahmani River flows into Bay of Bengal in Kendrapa and forms a huge delta along with Mahanadi and Baitarani. Now let's discuss about Baitarani River. The Baitarani River rises near Dumuria village in the hill ranges of Kiyunja district of Odisha. The river is called Gupt Ganga or the Gupt Baitarani in the upper parts of the river. The river originates and flows mainly in Odisha but for a very small stretch it flows in West Singhung district of Jharkhand. The Baitarani is also called Dhamra in the lower parts of the river. The Baitarani river joins a distributary of Brahmani river. After the confluence, the Baitarani river then flows into Bay of Bengal near Chandabali. In the delta formed by the Baitarani as well as Brahmani river, we find Bitharkanika National Park. There is Bitharkanika Wildlife Sanctuary as well as Gahira Mata Marine Sanctuary. In the mouth of Baitarani river, we have Wheeler Island. This island is also called Abdul Kalam Island. This island is used for testing missiles of India. The next important river of Odisha is Subarnaka. The Subarnaka river originates in Rachi district of Jharkhand. The Subarnaka river flows through East Singhum district. The Subarnaka river in East Singhum district meets Kharkai river, which is a major tributary of Subarnaka river. The Kharkai river originates from Mayurbhans district in Odisha and it forms a short boundary between Odisha and Jharkhand before meeting Subarnaka in Jamshedpur. From East Singhung district, Subarnaka river enters Odisha in Mayurbhans district. From here, the Subarnaka river flows into Jhargram district of West Bengal. Subarnaka river then again flows back into Odisha in Baleswar district of Odisha. Now let's discuss about our next important river that is Budhabalang. The Budhabalang river originates in Mayurbhanj district in Simlipal National Park and Simlipal Tiger Reserve. The river then flows into Baleswar district of Odisha where it meets Bay of Bengal. The next important river of Odisha is Rusikulya river. The Rusikulya river originates in Kandamal district of Odisha and flows into Ganjam district of Odisha where it flows into Bay of Bengal. The place where the river originates is called Kashmir of Odisha. The Rusikulya river mouth is important breeding ground for olive ridley sea turtles. Next important river of Odisha and Andhra Pradesh is Vamsadhara. The river originates in Odisha on the borders of Raigada and Kalahandi district of Odisha. The Vamsadhara river then enters Andhra Pradesh in Parvati Puram district. It flows into Bay of Bengal in Sri Kakulam district of Andhra Pradesh. 
Another important river of Andhra Pradesh and Odisha is Nagavalli River. The Nagavalli River originates from Kalahandi district and enters Andhra Pradesh in Parvati Puram Manyam district. Swarnamukhi and Begavati are two tributaries of Nagavalli River which join Nagavalli River in Vizinagaram district. The Nagavalli River then flows into Bay of Bengal in Sri Kakulam district of Andhra Pradesh. I hope you like this video and if you have liked then please subscribe and share with your friends. Do follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Thank you.